I like your pencil, Eric. It's real cute. You like that? It fits your personality. Yes, it does. <laughs> I'm gonna go drink lemonade. You have fun. I'm Montana Dana, and in today's episode of Girl vs. Van, I find new and cute ways to insulate, fasten beams into the frame so we can hang up the slats for the ceiling, and let me tell you, they're chipping Joanna AF. So earlier in the day, I put up the shiplap. Come on, help! Someone please help. Now I'm heading over to my friends, Eric and Corinne's for a little help. First things first though, and what I'm going to Lowe's for is to get boards that will go across the top here. I'm gonna need one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, that's what we're doing. Screw in with self-tapping screws up there. And then I'll have something to drill into when I hang up these slats on the roof. Let's see how it goes. I freaking love Eric and Corinne. They're such sweet people. They're always so welcoming. They offered to let me use their tools. They cook me dinner. They help me with the van build. And they're freaking hilarious. I like your pencil, Eric. It's real cute. You like that? It fits your personality. Yes, it does. <laughs> <laughs> Totes adored. Totes adored. Eric is helping me today, doing some cutting. We're gonna put these little beams on the ceiling and then put in a fan. Yeah, Actually, we are. I'm gonna go drink lemonade. You have fun. Oh, you have fun. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh. beams to fit today so it's something to nail the ceiling into. Eric just cut some notches in here so we can get it a little more flush with the ceiling because it's bowed and we're just going to go straight with the panels. I think that'll look good. Cool. Is, that, good. is that fitting flush with the thing? I don't yeah, know. it's sitting right up there. We're good. Earlier today, I did not pre-drill holes into my ship lap when drilling into metal. <laughs> We got this. Well, I learned my lesson, and we pre-drill in some holes. Hello. <laughs> one that had trouble drilling into metal. Even Dwalt drill couldn't drill into metal without a little brute force behind it. So I don't feel so bad about this morning. <laughs> Seriously, almost need something to like push it again. I know, I can see through though. Those are on there. Yeah. Do some pull-ups or what? Yeah. Yeah, why not? Might as well. <laughs> we'll get a pull-up bar and Yeah. Jack. That looks good. Yeah. Sweet. All right, we got a couple of the studs in and then I'm gonna drill into these when I put up the ceiling. Ooh, it's so hard to drill in the metal. It's like a situation. So Eric came up with a good idea to pre-drill into the metal first and then it's a little easier to drill in the rest. But these are in there. Very excited. The ceiling's gonna go up here, so I need to find something to cover this. Maybe I'll put shelving in at some point. Not quite sure yet. So foam board insulation and I have come a long way in our relationship. Earlier today, we started here. I already packed all my kitchen knives, so I guess we're gluing this into the wall now. Then we made it here. <laughs> oh. Whoops. And now we're cutting foam board like a champ. I even had some little helpers. He's gonna cry to check. Okay. Got her back up. Yeah. yeah. Cry to chop. There. Yep. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, nice. Who's gonna karate chop this one? Me! Me! Me, me Dana! Me! Well, I'm gonna... I get the big one. Alright, so we're 
right, Shorty, you're gonna have to karate chop it right here. You ready? So this will get me? Right there. On your mark. Yes. Karate chop! <laughs> okay, so guys, we have to do this line. Yeah. On your mark. Yes, sir. Wait, there's one more. There's one more. Oh. It's right here. Oh. <laughs> right here. Okay. On your, well, it has to go in the middle. Oh, you got it. I'll let you do the next one. Oh. Now that we got our little ninjas helping us break some foam board, we're insulating the ceiling. Wait. Back on, girl. Do you want a tree? Do you want a flower? I like the one you did originally. <laughs> you saw that? I saw that. What? That made me laugh. I'm a 12 year old boy. I Nothing don't know wrong why. with that. It's not been funny for so long that it's like funny again. Yeah. I don't know why. You're like, what? What do those look like? <laughs> I haven't seen one forever. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I hate it when you're right. I know. Hello, miss. Should we take you to the ceiling? Why not? You want to hang out on the ceiling, sweetie? Sounds fun to me. Okay. Well, all right. So this will help with sound deadening. Yeah, soundproofing. And, and weather. So if you come across cool. snow or super hot. heat, it keeps it cool in here because it gets real hot. Even during the normal days, it gets pretty yeah, hot. Yeah, it gets toasty Excuse bad. Me. That'll help out a lot. And then I'll put Reflectix over it. That it's like bubble wrap with. Yeah, it's this stuff right here. Yeah. Right. All right, we're getting insulation and Reflectix put in the ceiling. High five. Hey. I love this thing. It's so cool. So I had so much footage on this day, it's turning into three videos. So I'm gonna upload the skylight video tomorrow. If you missed the first part of day two, you can watch it after this. It's pretty special is the word I would use, special. Mm. Gonna like lay down, look at the stars at night. They're even gonna feed me and everything. Getting spoiled over here. So for dinner, Corinne made this like buffalo chicken Instapot sandwich type of thing. I wish I would have recorded it, but I was super hangry, so I scarfed it down, but it was so delicious. They fed me, they gave me tools, they gave me help. Watching back this footage makes me tired and very, very grateful for their help. So thank you guys. Sands looking good. Hallelujah. We got all the ceiling reflectix in. Thanks to Eric. I don't know how I would have done that by myself. The sides were hard, but holding something up on the ceiling and taping would have taken forever. I still think I'd be there right now today. Me and Black and Decker trying to put up ceiling panels. So thank you, Eric. Thank you, Corinne. You guys are amazing. And now we are putting in the ceiling panels. They're going in. Oh, wow. That's way better than fairy lights. There we go. Yes. <laughs> Right in the line of fire right there. Uh, it's just a blowback, sorry. <laughs> so the boards are going in super fast, super easy. Now Eric's gonna use the jigsaw to cut out the boards to fit around the skylight. Cut you out of this, make it look like I did all the work. That's fine. I will not. Were you doing two or three in each? Two. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Very nice. We've got a ceiling. We're just stripping a piece of wood to fit in here. Then we're gonna have to cut some boards to fit. Here. but it's working it's going so fast with the nail gun too i'm really happy really happy about it day two is complete on the van build we got so much done today thank you so much to eric and corinne i never would have put that skylight in by myself i don't think you've got the power you can do it <gasps> why does it <laughs> And this is how to ruin your bed. Okay. What amazing friends. I'm so ready for bed, but I have people coming over buying some of my stuff. Look, I have turned my entryway into a little boutique. Oh my gosh, look at all of these cute clothes. Shorts over here, boots over here. I'm selling all the things and every penny is going toward the van bill. This is my living room right now. I still have it set up in the old layout. I have six more days. My goal is to day after tomorrow, move all this furniture into my van, not to mention build a bed frame. Tomorrow we'll finish up the ceiling and the siding. I'm gonna spray paint the panels on my doors so they're white and they match everything. I was gonna shiplap them, but I think it's too much work and materials right now. And I don't really know how to fasten them because you can't drill into the door, it'll go straight through. So I'm gonna spray paint them for now. 
and I can always change it later. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Girl vs. Van. In tomorrow's video, we're gonna install the skylight, and then I have five days left to finish the van build. Subscribe if you haven't already. After the build series, we're going on some adventures. I hope you'll join me. Please subscribe, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you loved it, share it with your friends. We'll see you tomorrow.